Did you know there's a place to get delicious barbecue and shaved ice right here in downtown Peculiar? We're gonna tell you all about it on Highlight My Town. Welcome to Highlight My Town. I'm Dan Edson with EXP Realty. I'm here with Paul and Jen Kilgore, the owners of Padula's Place Barbecue. And you guys have been in business for how long now? Uh, Full-fledged barbecue. We've been in the building since January 20th, but we've been, Padula's Place has been in existence since August 8th. Wow, so you guys are a new business, mm -hmm. kind of born out of the pandemic, you were saying. Yeah, absolutely. When the uh, pandemic hit, uh, I lost my job. I've uh, been in uh, healthcare food service management for about 11 and a half years, restaurants for over 20. Um, and we thought, let's do this for ourselves. And uh, so we opened up a little shaved ice shack out of a yellow trailer that's right out back. Um, sat out there in some sweltering heats on August 8th. And in about mid-October, we started rolling some pulled pork and started doing some brisket and a big old smoker and got inside and now it's, it's rocking and rolling time. Wow, and I've read some of the Google reviews and you guys have been getting some good reviews here in town. So. We've been very humbled with some of the feedback, yeah, because, uh, uh, you know, it's one thing to say we're going to do something like shaved ice, which is pretty, you know, pretty basic. You mix the syrup, you, you put it in the snow cone, it's fine, but uh, when you're cooking something and you're putting your heart and soul in it, you get a positive response back. That's, it, it's, it's humbling. So, uh, we're, we're very grateful for the response. So tell me what's popular here at the eatery. I know you guys sell barbecue, shaved guys, kids love that. Sure, it's, it really depends on the season. Um, so we're just now getting into the warmer weather where the shaved ice is going to be really popular. Um, but let's be honest, barbecue is popular all the time. Everybody loves, Everybody loves barbecue. Um, but as far as like, what are we getting known for? Our pulled pork sandwich is kind of put us on the map. It's super tender. I mean, it's slow smoke for 10 hours. It, almost melts in your mouth and it's ridiculously good. Um, but our signature sandwich is the Padular. Uh, go figure. Um, <laughs> but that's our pulled pork sandwich with our slow smoked brisket topped with barbecue sauce, cheddar cheese, and pickles. It's one of those sandwiches when you open up the lid, you look at it, you kind of want to oh man, I gotta take a picture of that. It's pretty impressive. But our shaved ice is, is where we started, so that's kind of our, uh, um, that, that's what we love is the shaved ice too. Uh, and the flavors are so accurate. Uh, I had a friend of mine that came and tried it and he got kiwi. And he's like, I can almost taste the fuzz. You know, kiwi's got that little little fuzziness to it. And he's like, how do you do that? Ah, it's just really good. So, Man, it sounds delicious. Yeah, it is really good and refreshing. And you know, people say it's a summer treat, but I don't see Dairy Queen closing in the winter. So we don't, we don't stop serving shaved ice just because it's cold outside. So you all offer family-friendly service, and you were telling me, Jen, that it's all about community here at the Doolers Place. It is. We we love this community. Um, before we lived down here, we lived in Independence. Uh -huh. Big city, um, a lot of commotion and noise all of the time. We love being in a smaller town and really wanted to invest in the community. So we want this to be a place where people always feel welcome, where you'll always get a welcoming smile, um, you'll always get good customer service, where if your kids um, spill a drink, it's not a big deal. We have kids, they spill drinks too. We all take care of it. We have sidewalk chalk outside so the kids can play you know, while they wait for their um, food or their shaved ice. And we just want everybody to feel um, very, like I say, very welcome. Yes. And you all offer some delicious quality food, so. They won't be disappointed when they come check this place out. That's always our goal: is a high quality food, and like I said, good good customer service. If there's ever something that people are not happy with, we want them to let us know because we'll make it right. It's very rare that we have someone who doesn't like a flavor of shaved ice, but on the rare occasion that that's happened, I've told them, "Give it back to me. Let's try a new kind, and I can only you know let them pick a new kind to try." So it's never scary to try something out of your usual. That's great. If you don't That's like awesome. it, then we'll, you can always go back to the to your usual that you know you like. Awesome. 
So I follow you guys on Facebook and I see a lot of stories that you guys write in the local groups and on your page. Tell us about the stories. Uh, well, funny thing about the stories, um, they're basically the adventures of Mr. Paduler and the Paduler family in the land of Paduler, yeah. um, which is basically peculiar. And uh, I had a lady come in one time and she looked at me and she goes, I'm disappointed that you're so young because I pictured Mr. Paduler as being this old guy out there sweeping. <laughs> and um, it, it all stemmed from my, me and my daughter. We, I, I wanted to be a novelist when I was when I was young, and I've been working on books and short, short stories and plays, and uh, and she writes, and so we were having this fun little back and forth one time about Paduler's place, and we sat there and we go, this would be kind of fun to do as like a little bit of a marketing thing, you know, yeah. just just write a little little short, you know, it takes two minutes to read, and then put your specials and stuff underneath it, and we've actually gotten quite a following with this. Um, I, I think they're entertaining and they're kind of fun, but uh, I, I think the interesting thing is that there's always something true. Like, like none of it is fully made up. Some of it's elaborated and, you know, maybe made a little funnier than it actually was, but it's all, all real true stories. So. There's an element of truth or real life in all of the stories that, that are written. Yeah, but my daughter gets asked all the time if she's the one who writes them, and she's like, no. <laughs> so it's, it's me. So when you read the stories, I'm Mr. Paduler. Uh, I'm Mrs. Paduler. That's Mrs. Paduler. Uh, and then you'll see Paduler Jr., Little Paduler Jr., and all these different things. So that's, that's really neat. That's I love it. it. So. I love it. So I noticed some smiley faces on the wall here in the store. Yeah, so uh, when we first moved in, my oldest daughter grabbed a Sharpie and went around and just randomly drew little smiley faces all over everything like random things like you wouldn't see them because they're little until you go up to a shelf and you go there's a smiley face there and there's a smiley face there and then you say hey did you do this and she's like yeah um so at the doulers it's become kind of our signature that anytime you order something on the top of the clamshell box and you put your food in we're going to write what it is and then we're going to give a little smiley face that's awesome so you'll have a smiley face every time you leave and when you go home we'll be smiling at you then too Thanks for letting us stop by your store today. This shaved ice is delicious. Uh, if people want to know here in the community, what are your hours? We're open Tuesday through Saturday. Most days are 11 to 7. On Wednesday, we do close earlier at 6, and Saturday we open at 2. But besides Wednesday, we're always here till 7. Sundays and Mondays, we're closed. Okay, and you guys do have a website, right? We do. You can uh, find us at www.padoolers.com or you can find us on Facebook at the Dealer's Place, and that's where we do the most um, updates, and um, our hours are listed on there. So. Support local, come out here and support this great family-run eatery. Have a great day, folks. Have a Padula day. <laughs>